Hi everyone, thank you for tuning in to Pace Yourself. Today we're going to add a simple product. So on my home page in CPQ, I'm going to go to our products page. Multiple options to add new products, you can click the drop down arrow there and click new product, or on the product object you can click new. Product name will be our first field to fill in. We're going to click and make it drone extended fly. Because we'll be creating a package out of this, so a bundle. Click active, give it a, a code, give it a family. There's a few other options here which we can go into further in other videos, but for now I'm going to just fill in the top few things and click save. As easy as that, we've created a new product. I now have to add pricing to the product to make sure it's visible on the quote. So I'm going to our related lists. And there are two key fields you have to make a pricing for. The cost. And you have to have a standard price Otherwise, it won't show up in any quotes. But there's one other thing I want to create and put on here, which is our product image. In previous videos, you might have seen me upload it into the Salesforce Classic and create the formula fields. So I'm going to copy my record ID put it in our product image and hit save. As you can see here, my product image is now onto my product page, ready for me to start creating our bundle and adding more features to it. So thank you for tuning in to Pace Yourself with me, a Pacey.